The struggle ends when the gratitude begins. Everybody is a happiness seeker. Everybody seeks for happiness. If you have a deeper look at everything that you do in your life, you will find that the infinite goal or the infinite purpose for you is to feel happy. A lot of researchers and psychological, you know, like researchers, they were defining uh, the happiness. And every time I, I read like a research, I figured out this definition is different. But the only thing that they have in common is the, the belief that gratitude can lead to happiness in some way. The easiest way to define happiness is the moment when you feel that you're grateful about anything. Gratitude is a human emotion. It's the state of thankfulness when you feel that you're appreciating what you have and you're thanking people around you, even God or whatever, for anything that you already have. This is the meaning or the simple meaning for being grateful or for the gratitude. Okay, in positive psychology, they define gratitude simply as an acknowledging of the things that you have in life. Like anything that you have, money, wealth, health, wife, kids, you name it. When I did this research, I found that, that being grateful has different or deeper uh, impact in your life. How can being grateful um, affect you physically or even psychologically or even socially? When you are grateful or you are satisfied about anything in life, it can affect your immune system. Can you believe that? The main system in your body to defend diseases can be stronger. And also the blood pressure and fighting or preventing you from getting uh, your stress level high or even uh, getting into a depression. So being grateful can help you like in, in different kind of ways and it physically can help you to be better a uh, human being. Okay, how the gratitude can give you like social benefits. When you're grateful, when you're satisfied with the things that you have or you're acknowledging the things that you have in your hand, it will help you to show empathy it will help you to be more involved with, with everybody around you. And most importantly, it will help you to have a good relationship. Because as you know, if you, for example, if you're married and there is a problem with satisfaction or you're not satisfied, then it can affect you in a bad way and can affect your marriage. But if you're grateful, if you're satisfied, then your relation will be stronger. You'll be a better person as well. Gratitude is related to happiness. When you're feeling grateful, you'll be much more happy in your life. And also regarding because it's psychological and you know, uh, as I mentioned earlier, it prevents you from or prevents you from uh, having depression or, or having stress. So it's all connected. If you're grateful, you're going you're gonna to feel or you're going to see the difference happening to your life. So how to be grateful? Robert Roulette says, if you try to enjoy the little things in life, one day you will realize they were big. So try to enjoy the little things that you have guys in your hand instead of wasting your time on the things that you don't have or you cannot control. And always remember, gratitude is associated with happiness. Thank you and see you soon.